In early drafts of Star Wars, Episode 6 Return of the Jedi, the Imperial capital planet was set to appear under the name Had Abaddon. During the development of Star Wars, Episode 1 The Phantom Menace, George Lucas officially adopted the name Coruscant for the planet, a name that was created by Timothy Zahn for his June 1991 Legends novel Heir to the Empire. The planet first appeared in the 1997 special edition of Return of the Jedi, which showed scenes on Coruscant of a jubilant population celebrating the demise of the Emperor, with its name first mentioned in The Phantom Menace. The prequel trilogy and the Star Wars, The Clone Wars film and television series showed Coruscant as a major center of activity and action. In Rogue One, a Star Wars story the planet is briefly revisited via the dreams of J.Y. and Erso, featuring her childhood on Coruscant with her father Galen Erso and Orson Krennic. Coruscant was a location in early versions of Star Wars, Episode 9, both in Colin Trevorrow's Duel of the Fate script and in the early concept stages for what became The Rise of Skywalker. For the latter, it eventually evolved into Exegol. Coruscant is implied to be the in-universe equivalent of Earth, due to its 24-hour days and 365-day years, its diameter being close to Earth's, Coruscant's 12,240 km versus Earth's 12,742 km mean diameter, and its status as the presumed in-universe homeworld of humans. While the word, Coruscant, meaning, glittering, or, sparkling, is usually pronounced in English as, KSKNT, with a hard, C, and with the stress on the second syllable, in the Star Wars canon, the pronunciation is, KSNT, with the second, C, being silent, and with stress on the first syllable.